clay is very addicting. It's about the surface and it's about the camaraderie. Clay goes through so many stages from wet clay to finished fired. Most schools actually have wood kilns, or many of them. Uh, we just happen to have a lot of them. There is nothing that you can compare what NAU has to any other school. The facility is world class. Wood firing is such a community sport. You say there's a wood firing happening, the work shows up, people show up. You really are sharing control of the whole glazing process. The loading of the kiln, the firing, the unloading. Will you give me just a giant chunk of wad, please? Yeah. It takes everyone, the whole crew, to fire the kiln. It brings the community together. When you see a good pot, it's, it's like Christmas, obviously. Like, I feel like people say that all the time, but it's very exciting. It's lovely. I made a lidded jar. The whole process took about nine days. So this came out of the Anagama. It's like a mug design I've been working on. This is all just ash glaze that happened naturally in the kiln. I really like to look at, you know, small details and designs that people put into their work. I enjoy slightly more complicated pots. I like lidded jars, I like teapots. My favorite part about this process was getting to learn from a community of people who have been firing for a while. We're sharing stories, we're building relationships. It's hard to, to do all of this by yourself, you know, but if you have a team of people that are interested, it becomes a lot easier and it becomes a lot of fun.